fucking nervous about doing YouTube. Please be nice to me. No. My issue with this comment and comments like it is that literally no person thinks their sexuality is their entire identity. Straight people just don't like when LGBTQ people talk about our sexuality or gender too much because you feel excluded. For the record, we're allowed to talk about it as much as we want because first of all, we just are. And second of all, it's kind of nice to talk about something opening and freely after years of struggling with it. It's nice to form bonds with other people who have shared your struggle. I'm sorry you don't share my struggle. I can't imagine what that must be like for you. Why gay? Gay. How are you doing?
<laughs> this is my favorite comment of the entire video. I have a question for God. Why? Once again, I'm not God, so I can't answer that for you. But if God responds, let me know what they said. Okay, that's all the energy I have right now. I think it's worth saying that there are, of course, legitimate criticisms of things that I've posted on Instagram. I'm not reading those in ASMR because I think it would come off as unnecessarily condescending. Also, I want to make a fun video and not intellectually respond to my critics. That'll be another video. Let me know if you're interested. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me on this little YouTube journey. I'm uh, getting tired. It's been a long day of being gay. I don't really know what the fuck I'm doing when it comes to YouTube, so I need you to be nice to me, and I also need you to like this video. I'm not asking you to like this video, I'm requiring it, and here's why. There are a lot of trolls on Instagram who don't like me, and who comment Trump 2020 on all of my pictures, and you've seen them, and you know who you are. So, in the event that they come and terrorize my YouTube channel, I need my like to dislike ratio to still be good. I am nothing without good optics. Thank you so much for watching. I love you. I don't know how to end YouTube videos.